nature of the health care legislation and uh, governmental health care, things like that, that, because I know we uh, attended one of your meetings where it was discussed that you know, if, if we went full or universal health care, we have significant revenue impact on the hospital. Is, is there any concern with, I mean, taking oral this and the impact, the potential impact of that? I think a very good question, and, and obviously we don't know what that reform is going to look like yet. Uh, but what we do know is that we've got to continue to, to manage costs. We've got to increase the quality of our care and the value we provide. And the Medicare is, as you know, moving toward a, a value-based system. So they're going to look at not only the cost, but also the outcomes of the patients. So we're working very, very hard to improve that and increase coordination. And, and the other thing, I think the other lesson is, you know, we, hospitals have tremendous fixed costs. Uh, a lot of investment, uh, a lot of, a lot of uh, you know, availability costs, if you will, running systems 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you know, what's important, we think, is scale and the larger base and patient base you can spread those those costs over, the, the, the lower your overall unit cost will be. And, and that was one of the driving reasons we looked at Smith uh, We certainly think that will add scale and as the larger system with them to have a lot more flexibility really to manage those costs. Your risk management people are working all the time to decrease rehospitalization related to pneumonia and ACS. And we're looking at all looking at all those things. Mr. Chairman and Commissioners, uh, I have asked uh, the attorney Eric uh, Walter to review all the legal documents concerning this. He has provided you the synopsis uh, of his eva evaluation. Also, ask Harrison Tillman to um, evaluate the numbers that Greg has presented. Uh, I believe he has made contact with you as well. And uh, we have dealt with Morgan King, specifically Bucky, over a number of years, uh, at least 10 years since I've been here, and I've worked with him previously. But um, he has evaluated our uh, lending or our, our borrowing capacity and uh, is uh, prepared to answer along with Harrison and Walker any questions that y'all might have concerning this. At some point I'd like it stated on the record that uh, us signing off on this has has no effect on our future ability to borrow so we're not we're not uh, tying the hands of future commissions if they need to go to the uh, debt service market for anything. Uh, the bond market for any monies um, that you know it's the stated opinion of the attorney and the and the uh, accounting consultant that they're comfortable being on record with that at that time. Raise your right hand. Yes, yes, I absolutely agree.